or this um, tour that this person goes on talking about the different places in Rapid here. You may have seen some of these places before, but you know what that one is right there, right? That is our dinosaur. Now, let's look. Oh, have you been downtown like this before? I bet you have. So there are some cars all downtown, which usually it's pretty packed, right? So look at this. They have gone downtown where we used to live, or we're in our town. So then it goes all around downtown. You can maybe see, is this some place you know? Oh, yeah, that's that. There's a president there, and there's the furniture area there. Look at this. This is really cool. Look at, you can see on top of Rapid City there. That's what it looks like as they pull away from Rapid City. And then you guys know where this is. This is Dinosaur Park. So he was like, what? Why are there dinosaurs here? This is craziness. So that's some ideas of where it's like. We'll maybe look through that this week. But we are going to first practice our words for this week. Our first one is down, D-O-W-N. Our next word is out, O-U-T. Then we have up, U-P, we have very, V-E-R-E, or V-E-R-Y, big, B-I-G, and spell, S-P-E-L-L. -L. So our goal um, today, like all days on Monday, is to make a prediction. So our goal is that we can make a prediction about this story that we're going to read. So this story is called Country Mouse and City Mouse. And in this story, we're going to learn about these mice. And one of them's a country mouse, and one of them is a city mouse. So we're going to be talking a lot about how their lives are same and different, just like we do throughout our weeks. So listen right now, because our goal is I can make a prediction about what will happen next. So listen here as we start. Once upon a time, there was a happy little mouse that lived in the country. One summer, she invited her cousin from the city to come visit her. When the cousin arrived, she tried to show him how pleasant and relaxing life in the country could be. They sat on the porch, looked up at the stars, and they listened to the crickets chirping. They nibbled on delicious country food, such as breadcrumbs, trees, bits, nuts, and berries. So what do you think is going to happen next in this story? Do you think that they are going to enjoy sitting there on the patio? Do you think they might go inside? Will they go to the park? You go ahead and write down your prediction. What do you think they're going to do next? <laughs> 